What? What, what, what? What the hell is this? Harumph, 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 harumph. I didn't get a harumph out of that guy. Give the governor harumph. Harumph. You watch your ass. I see you shiver with anticipation. Let the show begin. Hey, hey, everybody, this is David Heretic coming at you with another edition of Reactions, Reviews, and Rants. And tonight... Tonight! Okay, making their debut on the channel tonight. Tonight. We have Blindside. Yes, indeed. How about that? Blindside making their debut on the channel. Before we go any further, for those of you who are feeling inclined to doing all of the clicks and the likes and the bibbity bibbity bop, do me a favor, before you do all that stuff, please watch the whole video first, okay? Give me a chance to actually earn those clicks and likes. Now, after the video's done, if you still feel like doing all those clicks and likes, then by all means, feel free to click away. This comes as a request from Ian Franks, and Ian wanted to see me react to this song by Blindside called All of Us. Now, have I heard the song before? No, I have not. To the best of my knowledge, this does not resonate with me in any way, shape, or form. However, there's always a possibility I may have heard the song in passing and I just don't realize it. So as always, if I start listening to the song and I suddenly go, wait a second, I recognize this song. I'll let you know. That's the truth. You know me, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. This was posted by Atlantic Records, okay? And the video has 322,000 views. It'll get you there. Other than that, there's really nothing else left to say. Link to the original video will be down below in the video description for your viewing pleasure at your leisure. Let's get started. What do you say, are you ready? Are you ready? Because here we go. All right, here we go. Blindside, all of us official video. Wah, wah, wah. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Yeah, there we go. There's that word official coming off of their record label's official page. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Look, you know what I'm going to say, so I I'm not going to bother saying it. I'm, I'm just going to say we're going to have to wait and see what happens and hope for the best. All right, let's do this. All right, boy, let's do this. is so awkward the chorus feels very awkward like you're 
You ever heard the expression, you know, fast on the trigger, slow on the draw? It, it, it kind of sounds like that. It kind of sounds like they're shooting themselves in their own foot. Like, they start to get this, the, it going. They start to get the chorus going. It starts to sound interesting. It, it starts to have some life. And just as it's starting to, and it's like, okay, let's see where this goes. Boom! We hit that, we hit a brick wall. And it's like, we're going to stop any forward progression and we're going to go right back to the verses again. And it's like, why? You, you started to develop something that really could work out well for you. And it, it sounds like you could start to build your hook up. Like the hook was starting to form. And they just slammed on the brakes. No, I take that back. They didn't slam on the brakes. They drove straight into a steel reinforced concrete wall and just went bam. And the car just crumpled like an accordion. And then they stretched it out during the whole verse. They spent the whole verse stretching the car back out like an accordion, stretching it back out like they do in cartoons until it's right back to its original form, and you hear that sound, and th there it is, the car is right back to its original pristine form, and we're ready for the chorus again. And then we start driving down the chorus, and it's starting to move, it's starting to sound good, we're starting to build the hook, bam! Right back into that same wall, not even just any wall, the exact same wall, crash! Right into that steel reinforced, Concrete wall, the exact same spot even. And it's like, why? Why would you do that? Why would you stop this forward progression? I don't understand. It's like you get a breakaway in hockey. The, they get the pass up to you. You take it across the blue line. You beat both of the defenders. There's nothing between you and the goalie. And then all of a sudden, you wanted to take a shot, and psych, I'm not going to take the shot. I'm going to veer off to the left wing, and I'm just going to skate away. Wh wh why? Why would you do that? It doesn't make any sense. I don't understand. I do not understand the mentality here. Because, like I said, the chorus so far, the chorus is the only thing that's standing out to me, and they cut it short. Both times now, not just the first time, both times they've done that. And I'm just like, why? I don't understand. I don't get it. Why would you shoot yourself in your own foot? Makes no sense whatsoever. Anyway, <laughs> let's get back into this. <laughs> the guitar bend i'm just disappointed every single time uh, uh, no 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 this no 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 uh uh not a fan 
not even not even close to being a fan. Um I want to say some things, but I before I say them, I better be very sure that I'm going to feel comfortable saying them and I can stand by it. So I, I don't want to say them and then regret it later. No, if I'm going to say these things, I better make dang sure that uh, I believe what I'm going to say and I'll stand by it. So let me get my thoughts together. I'll see you in the review and we'll talk about it. Well, there you go, folks. That was Blindside with all of us. This was a request from Ian Franks. Ah, <laughs> yeah. Oh boy, okay, well, here's the thing, folks. I thought about it, and I am so glad I did. Because I, I wanna say some things, and before I say them, I wanna make sure that I can stand by them, and I can stick to them, and I don't change my mind and flip-flop. We had better make that sure. I'm glad I did, because I am gonna say those things, absolutely. I, I feel very justified saying them, and I'm gonna stick to them. So, let's start off with the score, shall we? On a scale of 1 to 10, oh, Nelly, I'm going to give that a 2.4. Yeah, 2.4. Look, I don't like giving low scores. I, I take no joy in it, but at the same time, if the song deserves it, I'm going to hand it out. So, yeah, a 2.4. Uh, yeah, that's the, score, that's the score I feel this song deserves. Let me tell you why. Why? This song sounds very stereotypical of like, I would say 80% of the songs written in the 2000s uh, when it came to hard rock bands, new metal bands, uh, you know, new hard rock bands, you, you, you name it. it. There's a bunch of bands and I'm, I'm sure you can name them off. Like you could throw, it's like throwing a dart at a, a, a all you gotta do is, you know, aim it at the dartboard and you're gonna hit something that sounds like this. Um, it, 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 it didn't sound unique, it didn't sound special at all. And, and if I'm being honest with you, musically, it, uninspiring to say the least. I mean, it, it, nothing original. I mean, I, look, I know we're all thieves. I know we are. But at the same time, you know, don't sit there and write a song that's gonna sound like every other band out there. Do something to make you stand out from the, the pack. You know what I mean? Uh, th th this just, it, it was uninspiring to say the least. Um, boring to say the worst. Uh, it was just, guys, this is a really bad song. It is. Uh, oh, let's, yeah, let's let, let's go down a 2.4. Uh, what does that mean exactly? Well, for starters, like I said, it's a really bad scale rating. Yeah, th this was a really bad song. It gets one out of five stars, and it gets a D minus letter grade. Not quite an F, but it's it is is getting towards there. So yeah, two point four, a really bad scale rating, a one out of five stars, and a D minus letter grade. Um, how did I get there? <laughs> I've already started, but I'm so glad you asked. I've already started. It, it just sounds like a bunch of other bands, uninspiring bands. Uh, that came from the, like, like I said, the 2000s is what this sounds like. This sounds very dated. Um, quarterly, nothing impressive, nothing hooking, nothing that makes me, you know, that, nothing that sinks his teeth or his fangs into me or his claws into me in any way. It just, it, the song didn't go anywhere. The only bright light that happened was the chorus. And I, I hesitate to say that because I talked about this at length during the reaction, so I'm not gonna spend a lot of time on it. But the only thing that started to show any signs of life and any signs of, okay, maybe maybe the song could go somewhere was the chorus. And I felt like every single time the chorus started, the minute that you heard that guitar bend, that you heard that bend, and all of a sudden right back into the verse again. And it's like, wait, 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 we were going somewhere with this chorus. So, so, things were starting to happen. It was starting to develop. It was starting to become interesting. And then you throw on the, you don't even throw on the brakes. You make a hard left and drive right down that alley, a very short alley, I might add, and you go right into a steel reinforced brick wall. And it's like, 
what was the point? It, it, the chorus almost felt pointless because it was never given a chance to develop. It was never given a chance to truly spread its wings and fly. Every single time the chorus would start, it would go for four measures. And then there's that guitar bend, and we're right back into the listless uh, verse again. And I just, I, ugh. I didn't enjoy this at all. It, it just, the song felt like it kept shooting itself in the foot. Even toward the end, where it became chorus, chorus, chorus. Here's the problem. Four, ver you know, four bars, one bar guitar bend, right back into the same thing again. Four bars, guitar bend, four bars, guitar bend, and that was it. And it's like, you take out the guitar bend and expand on the chorus. Let the chorus grow. Let the chorus take us somewhere. And instead, we got that same guitar bend every time signaling the end of anything that could have potentially been really nice and right back to it again. It, right right back to the beginning again. And it's... Uh, vocally, it was, this was painful too. I mean, vo this this was just not fun to listen to. Um, very uninspiring vocals to say the least now look this this was painful to listen to this, this and finding really honestly anything redeeming about the song is difficult the only reason i'm giving this a 2.4 and we're not down in the ones or zeros is because i did see glimmers of something that could be good something that could be really good even i don't know about great but it, it could have been really good and unfortunately, every single time, we just smacked right into that brick wall again. Every single time. I really wish they had taken the chorus, taken that stupid guitar bend out, and let it grow. Let it expand. Double the length. And let it take us somewhere to really give us a chance to have it sink, our fang, sink their fangs into us, sink their claws into us, and hook us. But every time it was just starting to guitar bend, bam, right back into the brick wall again. No, this was not fun. I will never listen to this ever again. This was this was a bad song, guys. This was a really bad song, which is why it's getting the real bad rating of a 2.4. So let's wrap everything up in a, in a bow. I, I can't even say it's a pretty bow or a shiny bow, but it's a bow nonetheless. We got a 2.4, which is a really bad scale rating, which is one out of five stars, which is a D minus letter grade. Take your pick. I don't care. Whichever one of those floats your boat. Final word, final score. I have spoken. Well, that's going to do it for this edition of Reactions, Reviews, and Rants. Hope you all enjoyed the show. Hopefully, I was able to entertain you. If I was able to put a smile on your face and brighten your day, then I did my job, and I'm so glad I could do it. If you guys feel like joining the fan base, go ahead and click on that button down there. If you guys want to like the video, go ahead and like the video. If you guys want to ring the bell, go ahead and ring the bell. It honestly doesn't make any difference at all to me, but if you guys feel like doing these things, well then by all means, feel free to do so. Well, that's going to do it for tonight, folks. Thank you very much for watching, and as always, this is David Heretic signing off, reminding you to stay fabulous and support each other. Later, peace.